going to touch the double arrows to get to shape shift. Here's shape shift, so I'm going to select that. Now the first thing before I do anything is I'm looking here where it says size, size 100%. Um, with that it means the whole pattern will be changed. I don't want that. I only want to change a little bit of the pattern. So I'm going to change the size down to, let's try 10%. Now to test what size that effect circle is going to be, I usually touch off to the side. Uh, that looks good. So now I'm going to zoom into here and the camera will focus on that and then we'll see what Shapeshift does. Okay. So when I put my stylus on the screen, you can see the green circle, the effect circle. Anything that's inside that circle will move, will be changed. So the first thing I'm going to do is touch up here and you can see how I am moving that loop in, into a better position. Now I want to change this too, so I'm going to put my stylus here and I'm going to drag this pattern over, it's kind of, there we go, that's better. You can see how I'm moving it in and I'll move this down a bit. And so now the pattern fits inside the block uh, much better. Now I'm going to pan over to the other side of the design because there's a bit here I want to change to. There, that's better. Let's go zoom out so we can see the whole thing. And now it fits much better within the block. So that's a practical use of Shapeshift.